up you guys welcome to my channel i'm kind of doing this video vlog style because um i'm actually about to head out um i just got back from class so i gotta um study real quick for my phlebotomy class i'm gonna shoot this quick video today's topic is how to get over a heartbreak um Nothing is wrong with my eyes, you guys. I, I'm just, I just love these shades. These are like my favorite shades or whatever. So basically, the um, the title of this video is how to get over a heartbreak. So um, I know it's around that time where guys like to creep off and do their own thing. You get, you ladies know what I'm talking about. You happen to be one of those girls who's dealing with um, infidelity or dealing with a heartbreak right now i just want to let you know sis it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay like seriously um i have a few tips to help you like deal with that um the first thing i would say is to go out do your own thing you know what i'm saying don't get too wrapped up in the next person go out go have a drink with your girls go out to eat do whatever it takes to get your mind off of that person who is making you sad you know even though it is even though there is like snow here and there but we are almost at that point where summer is about to kick in and like yes so we can't be out here depressed stressed out crying over these guys or if you're a guy and you're dealing with a heartbreak from a girl we just can't be out here stressing over nobody you know what i'm saying because like who doing that it's 2019 we're not doing no stressing over nobody all right so period so the next thing i would say is like this this some people might su not suggest this but i would say um I would say, um, yeah, won't you just find yourself a new boo? Now, I'm not saying, I'm not saying go crazy. That's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying that. But I'm just saying, find you somebody that you could text, you know, here and there. Go out on a cute date with or something. Just to get your mind off of whoever you, you know, whoever you trying to get over. Or another suggestion would be to just take some time off to yourself gather your thoughts you know come to terms with reality and the things that you're dealing with and just you know just say i'm gonna let this pain go i'm gonna let this hurt go and i'm gonna focus on me so in the meantime you could be like working on your goals you could be maybe picking up extra shifts at work you could be trying to focus on starting a business studying like shopping therapy whatever it takes for you to feel better about yourself and to feel happy again girl you gotta do it because we're not stressing i told y'all we're not stressing all 2019 over nobody all right we're not doing that this year so make sure you take heed of the words that i'm saying um because you know we've all dealt with heartbreak we all know how it feels to get your heart broken we all like if you gotta cry it out sis if you gotta cry it out if you gotta like talk it out with your homegirls even if you gotta vent to the person who actually broke your heart through text messages a diary you know whatever it takes whatever outlet that you may have to use i highly suggest that you use that outlet and take this time to just self-reflect and just to come to terms with you know come to terms with the situation that's presented in front of you and then like there's nothing really you could do and at the end of the day if someone doesn't respect you if someone doesn't appreciate and love you for who you are then you don't need them in your life anyway at the end of the day like things happen for a reason so if something is happening in your life and you feel as though that you know it's not working in your favor or you're like why me why is this happening to me and then try to reverse it and think on the brighter side of things maybe it's for a reason maybe it's to protect you or maybe it's for you to learn and to grow and maybe like like the universe is saying like no you be dealing with too much bs you go for anything you let people run you over so let me remove this situation out of your life and sometimes you have to give thanks for removal because you don't know what's going to replace that you know there might be something greater coming your way so take the time to heal take the time to 
better yourself take the time to self-reflect look at flaws that you may have had in the situation think of ways that think of ways you would um think of ways you would be better at communicating with the next person that you're involved with and try not to um weigh your emotions on your shoulders too much try not to take things so personal try to look at um the situation from someone else's view and just put yourself in someone else's shoes but at the end of the day like i said we all we've all dealt with heartbreak we know how it feels to get our heart broken and the best thing that you can do with that is just to just to take the time to heal you guys there's nothing really there's nothing else really there is to do to really get over that heartbreak it just takes time and sometimes time isn't even enough right like time sometimes time isn't it like sometimes you just want that person to make you feel better again you know but at the end of the day you can't trip off what you lose who you lose and you just gotta accept reality for what it is you gotta accept situations for what they are and you can't dwell on things you can't let circumstances in your life cause you unhappiness you have to find happiness and you have to be happy internally shouldn't nobody shouldn't no one affect your happiness shouldn't no one your happiness shouldn't be based on how people treat you or what's being done for you or the attention that you're receiving if you're going to be happy, be happy with yourself. And if you're having troubles and you're struggling with finding happiness, then you need to look at things that you have in your life and learn how to be grateful for the things that you have. The best advice that I can give anyone who's dealing with a heartbreak right now, I just want to let you know, I just want to let you know that <sighs> trouble doesn't last always, okay? Trouble don't last always. You know, there's a brighter day. There's always going to be a brighter day. And you're always going to find someone who is better who to treat who would treat you better and never trip off something that you lose okay never trip you gotta just you just gotta have a bossed up mentality you can't be oh woe is me why me why blah 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 you can't be like feeling like that you can't be thinking like that you just gotta have your mind stay on like a level of bossness if that's a word bossness you just gotta be like bossed up you just like oh he don't want me oh cool boo boo you don't have to want me because best believe these men out here they do want me i am a boss can nobody stand in my way nobody is better than me you know what i'm saying you gotta have a level of self-confidence and you you gotta get cocky on them if you gotta get cocky on them cockyana you gotta be cockyana okay because don't let these men play with y'all because they be trying to play with us they be trying to play with us. They be knowing like, oh, she she stuck on me. She'd do anything for me. I could do this. I could do, treat her like that. And those are the type of guys that you don't even want from the gym. Like, let's be real, sis. You don't want nobody like that anyway. So, it's their loss. Like, let them, let them lose you, girl. Let them lose you, girl. Let them lose you. That's their loss. So, I want to let everyone know out there that's dealing with a heartbreak, girl. You're a boss, okay? Look at you. You are beautiful. Don't let these don't let these good for nothing guys treat you or knock you down. So I hope this video could help you and I hope that your heart will mend and everything will be okay. But you got this. You got this. So this is just wrapping up the video, you guys. Um, thank you for coming to my channel. Thank you for checking out this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to your girl. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. Bye.